Oh, look at this. This is disgusting. Narc it out, and he's going to be disgusting too. Let's see, moving out of the way there. Oh, we take a lot of time when the cart return. It's right down there. Oh, that's not where the carts go. The cart returns right over there. What's that? The cart returns right that way. That's splitting the spots. Now it's harder for somebody to park there. Yeah, I know, but I ain't got time to. Oh, what are you so busy doing? What's up? What are you so busy doing? What's what are you so busy that you don't have time? Where are you going? Where are you going? There's some lazy bones. <laughs> lazy bones heart surgery that he's done. So oh goodness gracious. Come on, you're not that busy. Oh, yeah, yeah. Terrible. Just the worst. What did you put on my car? Oh, it's a magnet. It says I don't return my shopping cart like a jerk. Because that's what you did. You left it out. Even when I explained nicely how to take it back. Dude, no, that's for you. Because you didn't take your cart back where it belongs. Now it's blocking part of the spot. Take it off. Take them all, man. Yeah, yeah. So if everybody. What, are you going to leave it on my car? Well, until you take your cart back, yeah. There we go. The old, uh, everybody else did it, or these other three people did it, so now I can too. Now look, and that takes up about three by two out of that parking spot, because this guy's too lazy. That's, that's why people get paid to put the carts back. Sure, from the cart return, but they're not here right this second. Everybody, there's a guy getting paid. Eventually, yes, but in the meantime, the next person wants that's, to park it there. Doesn't matter. Yes, it does matter. Because that's why I was able to pull my car out, because he's got a spot there. People get paid. Right, eventually, to... sir. Not right now. It doesn't matter now. Yes, it does, because the next person that pulls paid. in there. No, people get Sir, paid. you're wrong. The next person no, that pulls. No, I but I do this professionally. You're wrong, the next person that pulls in there has to worry about your cart. You are does the next person that pulls in there have to worry about your cart, yes or no? The, yes. Dude, I was able to park there. Okay, great. Because I was able to put the cart back. I was able to put my car there. A guy can pull in and put. But not as well, because you blocked part of the spot. Matter, not as well. Dude. Yes, it does. What if they want to open their door? Well. Yes. Suck a dick. Not as That's not nice, sir. And what if I like sucking D's? I don't necessarily. Never tried, but I can imagine I would not. But again, it always develops because he, he wouldn't listen to what we were saying. He was yelling over us when, as we said, the next person that pulls into that cart, that spot. Now he's taking off, not even doing the toss. The next person that pulls that spot has, as we just showed, three feet by two feet less accessible spot area because you what if their car's bigger than yours? You were a selfish jerk. And you know. And you know it's wrong. Which again is why they have the carpet. I'll get that in just a moment. But oh, and speaking of which, this is one of those shopping centers that explicitly, explicitly explains, and not that you need an explanation because uh, you're not, you know, a four-year-old could figure this out. But there are signs, see these big yellow things over here in Arcateers? Our shopping carts are provided for your convenience. We do not restrict customers taking carts to the lot. However, we cannot be responsible for damages caused by carts left in the lot. Please return the carts to the store or corrals and help keep blah, 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 blah. They even thank them for a cooperation, they're polite like I am. But that guy, argumentative, wrong, and can't read. Oh, the water's there, yeah. You just put it in there. I broke yeah. my arm in February. <laughs> and they are... They're quite heavy, I am sure. Allow me. And I always forget my husband to sell him to get them. Well, that's what we're here for with the cart narcs. We use our cart narc strength to easily move water. But I know, even with a broken arm, you'll be happy to return your cart, won't you? Always. Because... And I get really angry when other people don't do it. Why do you think they don't do it? I think they're lazy and they think they're better than everybody else. <laughs> they think their time... Their time is more important than my time. Exactly. <laughs> and it's like the people who stop all the traffic at Trader Joe's, for instance, to back their car in. Right. And the guy who spent five minutes bumping up a cart onto the middle thing because the curb, for instance, yeah, you could have been done by now. <laughs> but they just they they got it in their brain. They just don't want to walk the thirty feet or whatever. It, it's not even that. <laughs> I, I like it. Park near the cart return, so I don't. Oh. You know what, ma'am? You got life figured out. Some people don't. I do. <laughs> so now, are you an organization or what? Yeah, so we're basically, what we do is we help politely and calmly direct folks who try to do what you were just talking about to the nirvana that is the cart return, which even says return carts here, you know. Please, you know. They're nice about it. They say, hey, you know what? We can't have somebody out here at every single spot all the time for you, so we'll put these nice, convenient locations for you. Well, there was a time 
But no, it was in Ohio. You had to pay to get a cart, and you had to bring it back to get your quarter or there, whatever it was back. Mm -hmm. Yeah, a lot of Europe has that, and certain. Uh, there's a chain called Aldi that's from Germany here yeah. in the U.S. that has I know that. Aldi, yeah. yeah, they're 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 spreading, and I like their message. We're okay. good. Anything else you need right now? Are you good? No, I am excellent. Thank you. It's just my left arm. Uh, thank you for the time, by the way. You're very nice. All right, we got a guy here in the. Oh, he's going the exact wrong way. He's headed over to. Curb Island, unfortunately, looks like when cart returns right down that way. If you can see it in our tears. Oh no! That's not where the carts go. The carts go right down there. The cart return. What's that? The carts go to the cart return, not the curb. Oh. You can take it back now if you want. Would you like me to take it back? That'd be awesome. And you know what? I'll take it back for you. No, I got it. You sure? Yeah. You positive? I missed my day of training. <laughs> That's a good attitude, sir. I really do appreciate it. Would you like a sticker? No. It's a positive sticker, but that's okay. Your choice. Your choice. I'll tell you, I'll grab this one. I didn't catch them in time. Yeah, that one, me too. Yes, sir. Oh, would you like? Oh, I'll tell you. Like? No, no, no. I'll get the cart. Oh, no. With, oh, you. Oh, really? Yeah. You sure? I used to do this for a living. I love this attitude. This is a great turnaround. Thank you so much. That's very nice right. of you. You're very sweet. What a great dude. I, I mean that honestly. Like, positive. He had a positive turn on everything. Yeah, I'll get some exercise. I need to do this. I mean, uh, that anyone can push carts, quite frankly. <laughs> but no, that's very sweet of it. That's very nice. Very cool. Great attitude. Didn't even want a sticker. So good for him. Narcoteers, I want to use this as a teaching moment because people will say, oh, I just split the one spot and it's not in the way. Well, one leads to two, leads to three, leads to four. And now you can't open this door, that door, that door, or that door. So people who say, oh, well, it's not really in anybody's way. Yeah, maybe not that little piece, but you start the cascade of terrible laziness that's evidenced here. Yeah, and our coteers, losers and idiots who don't watch all of our videos will often say, oh, you don't bust uh, young athletic dudes who are bigger, stronger, faster than you. And uh, that's not true. But another thing too is younger guys who are bigger, stronger, faster, typically do the right thing like this gentleman just did and return their carts. Thank you, sir. Good job. Appreciate it. Appreciate that. Thank you. Um, you know, because when you have, I mean, it's the, the basic maxim is if you put training and discipline into one part of your life, it will often, oftentimes go off into the rest of your life as evidenced by that man right there. So suck on eggs, haters. Now, narcoteers, this is just an obvious mess. But what happens when you just, oh, look at there's a dozen carts curved right here. And what does it do? People don't want to park. They want to park everywhere else around here. They don't want to park here. I wonder why that is. Is it that a little bit hard? Oh, goodness gracious, I'm going to let him go. Uh, is it that much harder to pull in? Yes, it's two, three feet extra. And again, if you got a like a van you want to back in or a truck or something with a tailgate that you want to let down and load your stuff in, you can't do that because these dozen or so, Jarek, about to almost use a curse word there, these dozen or so lazy bones said, eh, screw it. And you know what? It started probably just one lazy bone who said, eh, and the next person said, I'll do the same, and so on and so forth. It's classic human psychology and quite frankly disgusting, but we'll clean it up. Cart knocks out. <laughs>